All right. Gordy, welcome to San Antonio. Thank you. Hello, Katie. Give me one second. Let me give a little more audio here. All right. All right. Yeah. Now I'm going to get out. All right. Gordy, we'll get started with Jeff McDonald from the Express News. He's one of our local beat writers, and we'll get fired away. Hey, Gorgie, welcome to town. Um, first of all, just what have the last few days been been like for you going from, from Memphis to here? And, and um, you know, was, has it been kind of a whirlwind? Uh, it's, I mean, it's been expected, you know, that's what I expected to. I mean, there is nothing that just uh, is it's fast for me, but I mean, it's, it's good at the same time. You know, I travel smoothly. I got here, so things are good so far. Um, tell me about why you chose the Spurs. I'm sure you had other other options as well. Yeah, I mean, uh, it's just like you know, I feel like it was like a college recruiting again, all over again. Everybody gonna talk to you and tell you like why they want you to be in their team, and I think I feel comfortable uh, what I hear here, and you know if. That's why I'm here. I like the team. I like the way they play, and uh, so that's why I'm here. After years of playing against the Spurs, what what have you learned about about them? Sort of watching from afar. What did you like about the way they played? I mean, that's a system. They got a good system. You know, the ball don't stop. The ball move around. Uh, they play together. It's a together team, and they have a Hall of Fame coach that. Uh, you know, know how to run this team. So I'm, I'm pretty excited to see what, what they're all about. And, and personally, how do you, how do you think you fit and, and your skills fit with what the roster they've got and what they're trying to accomplish? I think I'm going to feel good. You know, I think uh, I'm defensive minded and uh, I can, I can shoot threes. You know, I can, I, I will feel good. I don't have any issues. You know, I'm, I'm a role player. And like I always said, I'm here to serve the team. Whatever way the coach wants me to use to help this basketball team, I'm, I'm willing to, to do it. Okay, thank you, and welcome again. Thank you. Thanks, Jeff. We'll go to Corey Harrison from Out of Bounds Podcast. Good morning, Gordy. What up? Corey from Out of Bounds Sports Podcast. Um, with signing coming you know, so deep into the season, um, with it being short, how long do you expect before you get acclimated to the new system? I mean, I don't know. I just got here. So, uh, I mean, I've been in this league for eight years now. Uh, I play, I play the sports more than anyone. You know, there is some players I already had in mind because you know, we had, we got to do the scar reports and everything. But, uh, you know, I'm willing to learn and uh, I'm excited for this. Thanks, Corey. Let's go to Tom Orsborn from the Express News. Um, I was curious about, um, Pop, you know, you, you said he's a Hall of Fame coach. Did he talk to you and kind of sell you on, on your role? Say it again. Did did Pop talk to you and kind of sell you on uh, how many minutes you would get, what your role would be? Did you talk to him and what you call the recruiting process? I think, like, this is, a, this is you know, it's a good team. And, and to me, it's not about, like, telling me how many minutes I play. I think minutes are on and – it's what I do on the court. You know, if I got it and contribute to help the team, and if feel like I can help the team in a big way, he gonna play me. And if you don't feel like it, it's gonna be the same. I mean, there is no secret, no secret on, on, on that. You play hard, you play well, you're gonna play. If not, then you're not gonna play. That is not the way I see things. Okay. And which um, which players do you know best? Who who do you know best on the team? I mean, I just I just got here. I know Trey. Trey was in Minnesota. I played with his brother. Uh, I know him before he got in the league, you know, when he was in high school. So I know Trey well. You know, uh, I got to meet some guys this morning. Uh, me and KBD, we was in Minnesota together. Cam, we was in Minnesota together. Uh, that's about it. Kato, uh, KJ, he uh, he was in Huntington Prep. So that's about it. And will you be able to play tonight? I mean, I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. I don't know nothing about that. Okay. All right. Thanks a lot. Welcome to town. Thanks, Tom. We'll wrap things up with uh, Lauren Chan from Spurs.com. 
Hey, um, you, you mentioned earlier, um, you know, really liking what you saw of the Spurs culture. You know, what, what did you see from afar for the last eight seasons? I mean, it's a great organization, you know. Uh, uh, I mean, it's, it's been like culture, like I said, uh, Pop is a Hall of Famer. Uh, I think they're doing the thing right here. Uh, I'm just excited to be here, you know. I mean, everything you want to be part of an organization and you don't want to be here, that is a problem. I think, I think they, they're first class on everything. Um, do, do you have any memories of RC going back to Basketball Without Borders or? Of course, of course. I know he's, uh, I know that family well, you know. I know RC, I know Ed, like, I know them way back. I was in Seeds Academy and they, they, they was there like, her sister actually was there a lot, you know. I remember all that. I know them before I start speaking English. You know, I know them way back. What impact has that had on on you? You know, up to now. I mean, not not. It don't really matter, but I think it's like kind of returning the favor. You know, uh, they've been helping me, helping my school uh, way back, and now like. I got a chance to play for your franchise. You know, I'm very excited, and I think it does a lot. And this, we can we can write a story about that. You know, I'm very excited to meet them again and be part of it. You know? And that's, it just teaches me like you gotta do the right things. You cannot cheat the game. You know, you cheat the game, the game will cheat you. So that's why I be like I'm very blessed to be in this situation today and. I got another chance today, and I gotta use the, the, the best of my ability. What, what do you remember about meeting RC when when you were at Seeds? Yeah, I was I was young, you know, I was like 15, 16 years old. So they was I didn't even like they were just there to helping all of us, you know, educating us, share some thoughts with us, and helping the, the school. Like I said, they they do a lot of charity stuff, and they was very helpful to Seeds. Thanks, Gordon. Even when we come in the States early, like a lot of my teammates there, like and was she was taking care of them, like helping them with, you know, until they set up. Awesome. Thanks so much. Welcome to San Antonio. Thank you. Thanks, Gordon. We'll see you tonight at the game. All right, man. Thank you, guys. Thank you.